Hi, I am Dr. Jayesh Kakkar and uh, I have been practicing in the field of the diabetic foot since the past 22 years. Today I want to put across some things as to what a diabetic needs to do as far as his foot problems are concerned, how to prevent them and what are the options available to treat them. Firstly, what kind of care should a diabetic take of his feet? The point to remember is that 40% of all hospital admissions in diabetics are because of foot problems and diabetics lose the sensation in their foot. So whenever they get injured, they are unable to feel it and by the time they realize the injury has taken place, the injury has become very big. Every diabetic must check his feet every day in the evening and see that there's no injury, there's no redness, there's no maceration in between the toes. This has to be incorporated into your daily life. I'll count out some points which you should generally be taking care of being a diabetic. To begin with, you start, no diabetic should wear a any slipper or any footwear which has a toe divider. The regular Hawaii chappal which we wear is not to be worn or something similar to that should not be worn. Two, every diabetic must wear a pair of socks before wearing any other footwear. Three, whenever you uh, a diabetic wears a shoe, he should check inside because as I told you earlier, there is lack of sensation. So in case there is a foreign body, a small stone or a small uh, a piece of wood or anything inside the shoe which can hurt your foot, you will not be able to feel it. So you must check it with your hands before putting on the shoe. Fourth is never use hot water to wash your feet. You can get burnt without realizing that the water is so hot that it is burning you. So you must check the temperature of the water with the elbow before uh, using it to wash your feet. A diabetic must not go for the so-called regular pedicures not to soak his feet for more than three to five minutes in water. Anything beyond that can damage the foot. All diabetics must clean in between the web spaces with alcohol. This is the web space. The space between the toes is known as the web space. So you need to, you can use a UD cologne, you can use an aftershave lotion, anything which is readily available in the house to keep these spaces dry. Do not put any ointment or any gel or any cream in between the toes. The moment you start putting that, the toes, the web spaces get moist and over time they will crack, they will macerate. Like when you keep your hand soaked in water for long, the hand becomes, the skin becomes white. So once it is white, the skin cracks and the infection enters through those cracks. As far as cutting toenails is concerned, a diabetic must cut his toenails square. Do not go into the corners of the nails. One thing which I forgot to mention but I, is the one of the most important things right in the beginning is that sugar control is of paramount importance to prevent any complication of diabetes. So don't go by, uh, you know, random sugar levels or uh, accepting sugar levels which are beyond normal. The normal values which are suggested are a 2 hours post meal value of 140 milligram percent of uh, blood sugar level and a fasting, 8 hour fasting sugar level of 110 milligram percent. The way to check the sugar levels is, I have seen that many patients, they use a, a glucometer in the house. Now, they don't know really how to use that glucometer. They will swab their finger and then prick with the needle and then keep pressing. You are not supposed to press when you check your blood sugar levels using a glucometer. Let your hand dangle like this for around 30 seconds. In the same position, swab the finger and then prick and you must get free flow of blood. That will give you a fairly accurate measure of your blood sugar levels. Now coming back to the foot, check your uh, uh, footwear before putting it on, wear socks, don't use hot water to wash, wipe in between the web spaces, do not put creams or oils or uh, gels in the web spaces. You must not apply oil on the foot anywhere. You must use a moisture based or a water based cream and that also like I said earlier not to be applied in between the web spaces. 